Greetings from Canada. Um, I'm Lacey Lee and I have just taken the most epic road trip of a lifetime. I put on about 9,000 kilometers, about 5,000 miles and drove from Canada down to Mexico, Mazatlan, and I'm back home again. I'm here and I am trying to figure out how I can make this full-time travel thing a reality for me. Obviously a huge part of, obviously a huge part of anybody's lifestyle, not just the RV lifestyle is finances and money. And uh, I came back to Canada because I went back to work. I got a contract. And so for those of you that don't know, I'm an automotive journalist and I am going to talk today about some of the cool technology that is available in Ford and Lincoln products that are going to be really helpful for anyone who is towing a trailer or an RV, a fifth wheel, a boat, etc. Now I've been an automotive journalist here in Canada for almost 15 years now. I am a co-host of a television show called Driving Television. I do freelance writing for an online publication, again, here in Canada called wheels.ca. And just recently, I've started doing some YouTube videos for a girl's guide to cars. My experience over the years has been mostly automotive because when it came to trucks, honestly, like trucks and SUVs, they terrified me. Um, they're big, aggressive, powerful, and it wasn't until just last year when I bought my very first RV, my Grand Design Imagine 2600 RB travel trailer, and actually towed something for the first time, did I really understand exactly what trucks and these full-size SUVs are really all about. And now that I've kind of figured out um, the RV side of things, I'm excited to be back home and get into some of these vehicles and look at how they're towing, look at the technology available and be able to really expand my knowledge in the automotive realm, more specifically when it comes to towing. This section of RVing and trucks is still relatively new to me. And I'm gonna share what I learned and really try to keep it simple. This footage um, that I'm showing you today was taken right when I got back to Canada, the end of March, early April. Unfortunately, I only had this 2019 Ford Expedition for a couple of days, so I didn't get a chance to hook up the trailer and do some towing. What I'm excited to share with you is specific technology, specific advancements that are available in Ford and Lincoln trucks and SUVs to make towing anything, a boat, a fifth wheel, a trailer, anything so much easier. And for those of you following my journey the last seven months or so, I'm frantically putting together my seven month full-time living RV update as well. That'll be up next week, I promise. Thank you guys, as always, for all your support. And if you enjoy what I have to say here today and you haven't already done so, please subscribe and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified when new videos come up. Have an awesome night and enjoy your summer. Hey guys, this week I have the 2019 Ford Expedition Limited Stealth. For 2018, this vehicle saw some updates, including an aluminum intensified platform as well as some styling cues. I'm not gonna spend too much time on that in the vlog today. What I'm really excited to share with you is some of the capabilities and amazing technology that Ford has available on some of their SUVs and their trucks if you plan on doing some towing. The aluminum intensive construction I mentioned earlier is what enables this new generation Expedition to be both lighter and larger than the previous generation. Ford's twin turbo V6 is paired to a 10 speed automatic. Tons of cup holders and tons of USB ports. There's a standard power folding third row and the third row is spacious enough that adults will not have to suffer to sit back there. 
This expedition does offer best in class towing. It's able to pull up to 9,200 pounds. Just remember, it does need to be properly equipped to tow that amount of weight. And part of that is adding on the heavy duty trailer tow package. Backup cameras have to be one of my favorite new technologies in the last few years. Not only does it make parking any vehicle a breeze, Backup cameras nowadays, especially on a vehicle like this Expedition, make connecting a trailer or even a gooseneck type fifth wheel to your truck easy to do all by yourself. I did this myself, 100%. One very simple but incredibly useful part of this technology is the connection checklist located in the dash. Now, as an RV newbie, I found this to be incredibly useful and it's exactly what it sounds like. It's just a list of things you need to remember when connecting your trailer. Now I found over the last six months that even the most experienced RVers still have checklists. And I really appreciate the fact that Ford has included something so simple yet super powerful. It can easily be maneuvered from the buttons located on your steering wheel. Select the correct drive mode, tow haul, and away you go. RV and trailering tow guide PDF located online directly from Ford. And I've included the link to this PDF in the description down below. This is going to be incredibly useful information if you plan on doing any type of towing, whether it's a flatbed, open trailer, a boat trailer, enclosed trailer, or any kind of recreational vehicle. All the information you are going to need regarding the different vehicles, engines, chassis, gross combined weight rating, axle ratios, or technology is available on this PDF. And another super convenient feature is you can add more than one trailer. Let's say, for example, you tow a trailer for work and a boat on the weekend. This system allows you to name your trailers, set up the type of brake, the brake effort, and even specific measurements for the trailer blind spot system. This way, you only do the measurements once, and when you connect your trailer or your boat, the system will automatically remember the settings for you. And last, but definitely not least, is Ford's Pro Trailer Backup Assist that is supposed to make backing up a trailer as easy as turning a knob. Now, unfortunately, I didn't have this expedition long enough to connect my trailer and do all the measurements, so I've booked another vehicle in the summer, and I'm going to do a full review on this system to see if it really does make backing up easier. The base model is 59.5 and the top of the line Platinum Max is going to cost you around 83.8. All the information you need to get on this vehicle is on the Ford website and don't forget about that really fabulous PDF if you are planning on doing some towing.